Tuck Tuck Trouble. With Shane the Chef. What a sight for an old sea dog's eyes. A fine catch if ever I saw one. Eddie? What? Charlie, leave my fish alone. Move there, Eddie. Town boy. God, stop it, you do. Eddie, Charlie. Oh. <laughs> there you are, Dad. Are you planning tonight's menu? Yes, I am. We're having something really exciting. Ooh, what is it? Well, tonight, Izzy, we are having... <laughs> cabbages. Cabbages? They're not exciting. <laughs> no, trust me, Izzy. They will be exciting and delicious. Shoo! Shoo! You pesky seabird! Down, Eddie! <laughs> Right then, Maggie will be here any minute with the cabbages. I'd better get the kitchen ready. Eddie, you're making it worse. Oh, whoa, whoa, oh, oh dear, this doesn't feel right. Oh. Problems, Maggie? I think it's the brakes, JG. They're just not working properly. Would you like me to take a look? I've been known to tinker with a tuck tuck from time to time. It probably just needs a tweak. Oh, thanks, JG. That'd be a big help. Now then, let's see what we've got. Hmm, all right. OK. Oh, that's interesting. Is it the brake discs? Maybe they're worn out. <laughs> yes! That's just what I was going to say. Oh, do you know, I might have some spares in my workshop somewhere. <laughs> I'll help you look for him. Eddie, Eddie, get out of Maggie's TikTok. Me, tuck tuck. Lord, <laughs> come back, Eddie. You don't know how to drive! Oh! Oh! oh. Cabbages! Oh, cabbages! Oh, here comes Maggie with my cabbages. Hiya, Maggie! <laughs> but... what? Eddie? Oh, stop that dog! <laughs> what? Oh, no. Izzy! He won't stop! Dad, be careful! Out of the way, quick! Oh, no! Watch out! Door! Oh. No! Oh. Wow! Oh, is that Shane? I think it might be. Help! Oh, oh. Brakes! They aren't working, Shane! Yes, I know! Try applying the handbrake, Shane. That ought to do it. OK, I've got it, I've got it. Sizzling saucepan. Now what am I going to do? Uh-oh. We'll think of something. <laughs> Whoa! Look out! Eddie! Jolly! The sea! Whoa! Whoa. Oh, cabbages! What is that noise? Mia, what is going on? Run away, Tuk Tuk Marapalenta. Shane can't stop. What? Oh, no. Hmm, I'm coming too. Don't go without me. Save my dad. Right, how do I stop this thing? Ah! Ah! Oh, 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 oh. Oh. No! Oh, no! Oh! Oh, no! Whoa! Come oh. back! Careful! Don't worry, I've got an idea. Good. What is it? You need to manually disengage the transmission. Manually what? What? With this. It's quite simple. Well, I can't do that. I'm a chef, not a mechanic. Possibly a tad impractical. I'll think of something else. Look out! Ah! Whoa! Oh. 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 oh, I feel like cabbage soup. Did someone say something? Help me! Help me! Oh. 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 Oh, cabbages! Oh, I'm sure I'm hearing things. Oh, 
help! Oh my! Calamity! Flying cabbages! Who oh, what a waste! I've got an idea, Mama Polenta! Go left a bit! Oh, hooray! Got one! Oh, now right! Oh, and, oh, and another! Ha! That's it! Oh, got one! Oh, got another! Keep going, Maggie! You're saving the cabbages! How much fuel is in the tank? Oh, I just filled her up. I was afraid you'd say that. Oh, these Series 7s are remarkably fuel efficient. Shane could be going all night. JG! Shane! Hi, hi. Oh. Help me! Help me! Oh, yes. Got it, I've got it. Oh, no! Oh. I haven't slowed down! Shane! Oh, my goodness! Oh. Ah. It's quiet in town today. <sighs> Let's make the most of it. Watch Look out! out! Oh, 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 oh. Oh. Wow! Ah. Wait, Mama Polenta! Is he out Dad! Dad! Oh. Oh. Whoa! Don't worry, I'm fine. Oh, oh! There's that noise again. Where is it coming from? Has it stopped yet? Sam, you were in the back all along. Are you okay? Yes, I'm fine. I'm sure everything will stop spinning eventually. You just take a moment. You've had quite a turn. Sam, what happened to all the cabbages? Well, they're all gone. They fell out of the back. Well, there goes tonight's menu. And to think that I thought cabbages weren't exciting. Ahem. <clears throat> Shane! Did you want the cabbages? <laughs> we seem to have caught a few. <laughs> Mama Polenta! Maggie! Oh, what can I say? Um, what about Maggie's tuk-tuk? Yeah, we can't leave it there. Now, all together, everyone! One, two, three, four! Here we go! Oh, Hooray! Oh, yeah. Amazing! Now who's hungry? Oh yes, please! Yes. So what do we need, Dad? A cake. We need onion, garlic, tomato, kidney beans, carrot, celery, and spices. Oh, and lots and lots of cabbage leaves. So. Let's get cooking! And there we go. Job done. Back of the oven. Yay! I was hit on the head again and again by tumbling cabbages. It reminds me of the time when I was trapped in a runaway tuk-tuk full of cabbages. <laughs> Wait a minute. This is that time. Well, I can tell you now, I'll never look at another cabbage ever again. Can't bear the sight of them. So, who's for cabbage leaves stuffed with vegetarian chilli? Me, me, me! Yum. I thought you couldn't look at another cabbage. Or, oh, yes. I'll start that tomorrow. <laughs> <laughs> Pony problem. With Shane the Chef. Huh? Morning, Maggie. What have you got for me today? Morning, Shane. Butternut squash, 
It's my biggest and best crop ever, and it's ready to harvest. <laughs> ah, sounds great. Izzy's class is on a nature walk today, so I'm making a barbecue lunch for them. I'll pick up some of your butternut squash later. See you in a bit. Bye, Shane. Right, here we are. Hooray! Amazing! Right, kids, today I want you to find and photograph interesting and different plants. Like an insect eating Venus flytrap. A giant one with tentacles and fangs and giant eyeballs. That would be interesting, Jayesh. But I don't think you'll see one of those. But look carefully. You'll be surprised by what you can find. Yeah. You might find a jay eating dandelion. <laughs> Look, Mr. Singh, ponies! Mind you don't go too near. They have a hefty kick. I'm starving. Don't worry, Mario. Dad's doing a barbecue lunch. Is he doing chips? I don't think even Dad can barbecue chips. Oh. Morning, Shane. Hi, JG. As promised, my compact barbecue. Guaranteed to fit into any vehicle and turn every outing into a barbecue treat. Oh, thanks, JG. Um, oh, yeah. I'm sorry, JG. It just doesn't fit with all this other stuff in here. Not as compact as I thought, eh? <laughs> I'll be right back. Um, JG, I need to get going. Oh, what am I going to do? Huh? JG! That is awesome! Just a little something I've been working on in my spare time. Pop the barbecue in the back and I'll come with you. Great, thanks. OK, let's go. Progress check, children. How's everybody doing? Oh, yeah, fantastic. Oh, this little purple flower looks familiar. I'm sure I've seen Dad use it in his cooking. In his cooking? You can't cook flowers. What have you found there, Mario? It's, uh, yeah, yellow flower. It's a dandelion. You can eat dandelion leaves in a salad. Ugh, I don't want a salad. I want a barbecue or chips. Ah, a wasp! Ah. Stay still, Mario. It won't hurt you if you just stay still. Oh. Ah. Don't be silly, Mario. It's just a wasp. I'm not afraid of wasps. Me neither. Ah. Please get off of me! A, a wasp! Mario, stay away from the ponies! You'll frighten them! Ah. 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 A wasp. Oh. Ah. Watch out! Phew, it's gone. Oh. Aha! Here we are, JG. Right, let's set up this barbecue first. Ugh. How do I set it up? Now, hold it with both hands, then one, two, three, and flick. Okay. One, two, three. And flick! Whoa! Whoa! It worked! Wow! I knew it would. Oh, brilliant! Shane, do you hear that? It sounds like... Sizzling saucepans! Ponies! Whoa, oh, whoa, 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 watch the food! No, 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 the ingredients! Oh, <laughs> oh. oh no! They've completely ruined the children's lunch. They're heading straight for Maggie's farm. We've got to stop them before they cause any more damage. Let's go. 
Here we go. Yep, we're gaining on them. You go left, I'll go right. We'll cut them off. Don't rev the engine. You'll scare them even more. I'm fine. How cool was that landing, eh? <laughs> Come on, we might still be able to catch them before they reach Maggie's farm. Maggie. Don't worry. I'll stop them. Oh, no! My butternut squash! Yeah, they, uh, squashed my lunch ingredients, too. I just don't know what I can do with them now. You know, Maggie, some of these butternut squashes only need a wash and they'll be fine. Is that our lunch? Ugh, oh, what a mess. The barbecue's here. But where's Dad? Huh? Hi, everyone. Hiya. Sorry lunch is a bit late. What lunch? The pony squashed it. Don't worry, Mario. We've managed to save some of Maggie's butternut squash, and I have the perfect recipe. I'm going to record this for the Shane the Chef channel. Right then, let's get cooking. Where's the sage? Oh, sorry, Shane. I didn't have any sage. Sage, that's it. I knew I recognised it. It's wild sage, right, Dad? That's right. Where was it? Not far. I'll be right back. Aha! There you are. Here you go, Dad. Oh, thanks, Izzy. That's brilliant. All I have to do is tear up the wild sage leaves and add them to the mix. So, let's get cooking again. There we go. Butternut squash fritters and fresh salad from Maggie's farm. Wow, that's great, Dad. Tuck in, everyone. Yummy. Delicious. Mmm, yum. Uh, yuck. Give it a try. OK. Oh, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Hey, it's not bad. See, I told you you'd like it. And there's one fritter left. Who'd like it? Huh? What's up? Hey! <laughs> awesome. <laughs> Hey there! JG! Well done! And you're just in time for the last fritter. Oh, thanks, Shane. <gasps> oh. Hey, get that back! <laughs> <laughs> Easy cheesy. With Shane the Chef! This isn't for you. It's Shane's sausage meat. <clears throat> Maggie? Oh, thanks, Shane. It's been non-stop since I set up my stall this morning. <laughs> oh, is that all you've got left? Yep. I sold all my fruit and all my veg. Except for these sweet potatoes. <laughs> Shane! 
Shane! Shane! Help! Eddie wants your sausage meat. Thanks, Mario. I'm going to use this to make sausages. They're going to be top of today's lunch menu. Down, Eddie. Eddie? <laughs> Stop it now. Oh! Whoa. <laughs> Look out, Shane! <sighs> Maggie? What's this? It's a sweet potato, Mario. They're like a potato, but sweet. <laughs> oh, yuck. That doesn't sound right. They're really tasty, Mario. The only potatoes I like are the ones that have been turned into chips. I tell you what, drop by the restaurant later and I'll make sure there are chips on the menu. Chips? You bet. Mario! Oops, gotta go. Um, can I take these? <laughs> of course. Just save some of whatever you make for me. <laughs> Thanks, Maggie. I'll see you later. <laughs> It's easy. Just dip it in the bucket and wipe it over the window. Can't I do it later? I'm starving. You clean the windows and I'll make a special dinner. Chips? Mama's special pasta. Oh, not again. Windows! <laughs> Hmm. What's this? Maggie had some leftover sweet potatoes and Mario mentioned chips. So I thought, hmm. oh, what's the problem, Izzy? I was cleaning the fridge and found these odd pieces of cheese. It seems such a waste to throw them out. Uh, you're right. It would be a waste. Tell you what, Izzy. Get the cheese grater. <laughs> Portion of chips. Give it to me. With salt and vinegar to have for my tea. Huh? I can't help it, Eddie. All I can think about is chips. <laughs> I bet Shane's making them right now. It's no good, Eddie. I've got to have some chips. That's the cheese grated. And the chips chopped. Chips? Sweet potato chips. Now to make the sausages. I've got to record this for the Shane the Chef channel. Let's get cooking. That's the sausages prepared. Now, back to the sweet potato chips. Come on, Eddie. Let's get those chips. cleaning going on. Now I arrange the sweet potato chips on a baking tray and season. Then drizzle some olive oil and... Oh, is that a customer? I'll go see. You keep going. 
Hello? Mario? Um, your dad promised me some chips and I wondered if they were ready yet? Sorry, Mario, not quite. Then add a little rosemary and into the oven they go. La 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 la. Hey! Sizzling saucepans! Eddie! Oh. <laughs> Give those back! <laughs> oh! Where is that boy? Mario! 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 Oops! Gotta go! Coming, Mama! Whoa! Eddie! Stop that dog! Eddie! This way, look! Sorry, Mama. Windows! Eddie! Where did he go? Huh? Look, there he is. Look! There Eddie. he goes! <laughs> Over there! I can see him! Dad, catch him! Got ya! No, I haven't. <laughs> Got you this time. Oh. Oh, Dad. Oh, Eddie. <sighs> what are we going to serve our customers now? Uh, ah, I think I've got just the thing. We've turned Maggie's leftovers into delicious sweet potato chips. And to make them extra special... We add the leftover cheese I found in the fridge. Good job, Izzy. Come here, you. All finished, Mama. Good boy, Mario. Now you can have those chips. Yeah, chips. Here are those chips I promised you, Mario. Ugh. You said you were making chips. That's right. Shane the Chef's easy, cheesy, sweet potato chips. <laughs> oh, when Mario said you promised him chips, I don't think this is what he had in mind. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> you fancy a chip? Oh, mmm, delicious. So this is what you did to my leftover sweet potatoes. Well, I'm so glad they didn't go to waste. Mmm. Mm. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> mm. oh. um. mm. Wow, Shane, they were great. Have you got any more? Oh, maybe Shane can make you some more later, after you've finished your chores. Chores? But I've finished cleaning the windows. The windows, yes. But, oh, Mario, the work is never done. Oh, Mama. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh, Mario. <laughs> oh, do I have to? Can't I have more chips? Parsnip and ammonium. With Shane the Chef. Wow, Dad, look at all this snow. Hi, Shane. <laughs> <laughs> Looks like someone else likes it too. It's as cold as a polar bear's nose today. Well, it's perfect for my spicy parsnip soup, though. Oh, now there's a real treat. Yep, Maggie's promised me a whole load of parsnips. They'll be all the sweeter after this freezing cold weather. Reminds me of the time when I drove a team of huskies through the frozen <laughs> wastes of Greenland. My toes turned into <gasps> popsicles. Sorry. <laughs> Sorry, Sam. Right, you are. Missed again, Mario. <laughs> Don't worry, I'll get you. Mario! <gasps> Uh-oh. Did you take those crunchy munchies from the deli counter? Um, what crunchy munchies, Mama? <laughs> oh, Eddie. To me, please. Mm. Uh, and the other one. I said these are for us.
after lunch, not before. <sighs> Sorry, Mama. Come on, let's go sledging. I think someone else wants to come too. <laughs> and I'd better get started on my soup. Maggie will be here with a parsnip soon. <laughs> I can't wait. <gasps> oh, neither can Sam. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Oh, this snow's so deep. Good thing the parsnips are protected under the polytunnel, or I'd never be able to dig them out, Millie. Oh, no! My polytunnel! Oh, how on earth am I going to get Shane's parsnips now? So there I was, stuck on an iceberg, floating out to sea with a homesick penguin. <sighs> yes, it is a very sad story. No, it's not your story, Sam. It's the onions. Oh. They get me every time. I know how to fix that. Try standing on one foot with a slice of bread in your mouth. It never fails. It's what all the top chefs do. Really? Well, all right, I'll give it a go. Oh, what will I lose? Ah! <sighs> Maybe it was for hiccups. Oh, I can't even see the parsnips, Millie, let alone dig them out. <laughs> Oh, you found one. Oi, don't eat it. You can have the leaves. Now, let's see. Oh, it's frozen solid. Maybe if I tried pulling them out. Hurry up. Oh. Phew, Eddie. Did you have two breakfasts today? You weigh a ton. Don't talk about food. I'm starving. Can't believe Mama took my crunchy munchies. <gasps> Look! A crunchy munchie. Must have fallen out in my pocket. Yum. I don't know how you can eat those. They're disgusting. <laughs> <laughs> They're not that bad, is he? I didn't say anything. <sighs> oh, dear. <gasps> it was Maggie. Look. <laughs> oh, whoa, duck! See? Thanks, Mario. I'm trying to dig these parsnips up for Shane, but I'm not having much luck. We'll help you. Yeah, but <laughs> what about the sledging? Mario. OK, of course. Hey, Eddie, stop. <laughs> Looks like Eddie started helping already. Sorry about that, Shane. <gasps> oh, I remember now. You put a teaspoon in your mouth. That's what my old grandmother used to do. Yeah. I think I'll just soak the onions in water, Sam. It's much safer. Yeah, that's strange. No water coming out. Sizzling saucepans. No. Oh, I hope the pipes aren't frozen. Hmm. There you go. Mario, you're supposed to be helping. I am. I just made a snowman with all the snow I shoveled. <sighs> well, it's got to go somewhere. Mario! <laughs> it's not fair, ready. I am working hard. <laughs> hey, leave that alone. <laughs> Come back! Come back! <sighs> yep, they're frozen, all right. It's this cold weather that's gone and done it. Now, as I was saying, when I was in Greenland with those huskies... Uh, Sam, sorry. Look, I've got to get these pipes defrosted or I'll have to close the restaurant. I used to heat up my sleeping bag with a hairdryer. Lovely and warm it was. All the huskies would snuggle up to me and... A hairdryer? That's a great idea, Sam. Yeah? Uh, only problem is, we don't have a hairdryer. I have. Huh? It, it's Eddie's. He gets snow bubbles in his fur. Oh. <laughs> One, two, three, pull! Pull! <laughs> Oh, it's no use. It's just too hard. Maybe if Mario pulled as well. Yeah. Where is Mario? Whoa. Cool sledging here, Eddie. Hey, now we're here, we may as well sledge down. Come on, Eddie. Here we go. Whoa, this is fun. Uh-oh, too fast. Too fast! Try it now. Ah, she flows! Fantastic! Thanks, Sam. Right, now I can crack on with my soup. 
Well, I hope Maggie's on her way with those parsnips. She's cutting it a bit fine. Oh, I think it's time to give up, kids. Uh. We've been digging for hours and we've still only got one parsnip. And the snowman's got that. Oh, I'd better call Shane. He's going to be so disappointed. Whoa, watch out, oh. Eddie! We've gone too far! Watch out! Ah. Oh, no! Ouch! Ah. Look out! Oh. Mario! Oh, no! Phew! Ah. Mario! Sorry, Maggie. I didn't do it on purpose. Honest. You're a genius! I am? You've solved our parsnip problem! Yeah, Well okay. done! Hello, Shane. Is Mario back yet? Uh, what are you doing? <coughs> Pardon? The teaspoon stops him crying when he's chopping onions. Oh, well, I never. Well, it actually kind of works. All I need now are the parsnips. Did anyone say parsnips? Whoa! That's a good haul. Sorry they're late. We had a bit of trouble digging them out. Well, till Mario arrived. <laughs> Eddie and I saved the day, didn't we, Eddie? <coughs> I think I deserve my crunchy munchies now, Mama. All right. As long as you eat your lunch. Yes! Uh, excuse me. There's nothing fresh in there. I could make you something much tastier. Better than crunchy munchies? No way. I'll show you if you like. But first, my spicy parsnip soup. So, you chop the parsnips, into the stock they go, a pinch of Mama Polenta's spices, and we'll leave that to bubble away. Then I blend it, and it's done. Is that it? It's easy. Easy and delicious. Now for my parsnip crisps. Parsnip crisps? Yep. Give them a good scrub, slice them up, touch of oil, Bish bash bosh. What are we waiting for? Let's get cooking! Yay! I'm still not sure about parsnip crisps. Here we go. Spicy parsnip soup. And parsnip crisps. Delicious. Ta-da! Mmm, yummy. Mm -hmm. mm. Oh, delicious. Mm. Wow, mm. yummy. Mario? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Mmm. They're okay. Better than OK, actually. I think he likes them. Yeah. Mm. I'll just give these to Eddie. <laughs> well, I think that says it all, doesn't it? <laughs> <laughs> no go-kart. With Shane the Chef. Hiya. Hi, Maggie. Wow. Did you make that all by yourself, Izzy? Yes. Dad started me off, but he's really busy with the restaurant. <laughs> that sounds like Shane. He must be planning something special for after the go-kart race. Ta-da! Lamb and vegetable kebabs in a rosemary marinade. Mmm. Is that what all these veggies are for? Ah, yes, let me check. Courgettes, peppers, tomatoes and onions. That's the lot. Thanks for dropping them off, Maggie. I'm preparing everything early so I can help Izzy with her go-kart. Then it's kebabs for everyone after the race. Nice car, Izzy. Any special features? Uh, I wasn't planning any. How about you? We've designed it so it's really aerodynamic, haven't we, Dad? Yeah. A aerodynamic? Streamlined, so the cart goes faster. See you at the starting line. Bye. <sighs> I see you've got your kebab skewers out ready, Shane. Yep, and once these courgettes are chopped, I'll just need to make a rosemary marinade for the lamb. You are organised today. Gotta be, if I'm going to help Izzy and serve kebabs to everyone later. Well, make sure you save me one. <laughs> right, I'd better get everyone ready for the race. See you later, Shane. Bye. 
Now, I just need the rosemary. There should be plenty in Izzy's herb pots. Right, uh, driver Izzy and, uh, oh, what's the name of your cart? Um, how about Fresh and Simple? Fresh and Simple? Ha, I like it. Hello, Izzy. Mmm, making a go-kart, are you? Yeah, do you like it? Mm, looks stable enough, but I could think of a few things that could be tweaked. Well, I'm trying to keep things simple. Oh, no! Izzy! Sorry, JG. Gotta go. Bye, Izzy. Hmm, go cards. Interesting. The rosemary doesn't look very happy, Izzy. What do you think is wrong with it? That's odd. It's soaking wet. I've been watering it every day for you. Is that not good? I think it's got root rot. Rosemary plants like dry soil. Oh. I'm sorry, Izzy. That's OK, Dad. We can still save it if I dry the soil out. But it's no use for today. What are we going to do about your marinade? Well, I'll give Maggie a call. I think she has a rosemary bush. What's the name of your cart? My cart's called the Busy Bee. Thanks, honey. And mine's the Atomic Rocket. Dad helped me get it aerodynamic. <laughs> oh, that's my phone. Hello, Shane. Yeah? Yeah, of course. There's a huge rosemary bush next to my house. Take as much as you like. Oh, but you better hurry. The race will be starting soon. Can you get the car up to the start line, Izzy? I'll join you as soon as I've got that rosemary. I'll just put these back in your toolbox first. Good thinking. On second thoughts, bring the whole toolbox up to the start line, just in case we need something. And don't worry, Izzy. I promise I'll be there to push you off. Hmm. Toolbox, toolbox. Ah, toolbox. Here we go. <sighs> Hi, Izzy. Here, Izzy. There's room next to me. Thanks, Mario. Hold the start line, Maggie. Uh, uh, what have you got there, JG? My go-kart, of course. I didn't know you were racing, JG. When I saw how much fun Izzy was having putting her cart together, I didn't want to miss out. So I put this little thing together. That is all right, isn't it? Of course. The more the merrier. Fabulous. In that case, meet the Turbo <gasps> Auto Boost Mega Cart. <gasps> Drive boost, check. Steering wheel, check. Auto push off, check. Um, JG, what does this red button do? Well, that's the emergency braking system, Jay, which I won't need because I can steer myself out of trouble. Oops! <laughs> Has anyone got a screwdriver? I have. You can use anything in here. Thanks, Izzy. Race starting any minute, JG. Hurry up! <gasps> that's plenty of rosemary. Time to get back. <laughs> Sizzling saucepan. Millie, I don't have time for this. Bring that back. One more tweak and... Oh, now the connector is broken too. Hmm. Perhaps there is something else in the toolbox I can use. What have we here? I could use these for precision steering control. Race starting any minute, JG. Oh, calamity! Give it to me. <laughs> Oh, finally. <laughs> you better not have made me late for the race, Millie. Starting positions, everyone. Wait for me. Ah, there. All fixed. Genius. Even if I do say so myself. 30 seconds to start time. But Dad's not here yet. Oh, I'm sorry, Izzy. But we can't wait any longer. <sighs> Dad! I'm here, I'm here. Don't worry, don't worry. <gasps> you made it! You ready for the big push, Izzy? Yes. 15 seconds! Check seat belts, helmets, on your marks. Get set. Here we go. Go! <laughs> here we go. Ah, watch out! Oh, 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 okay. Shane! Dad? I'm fine. Just keep driving. Hurry up, Mario. Hey, that's not fair. Dad, 
Your extra weight is speeding me up. Well, I'm glad to help. Yay! Oh, wow! Any faster. Ooh. I'm gonna get you. <laughs> Quick! Izzy! Oh, here we go. Dad, this huh? is brilliant. Are we winning? Jay, watch out! Whoa! Left, right. No! My aerodynamics have failed me. How's it going out there? Amazing! Come on, Jay, Jay. And... Whoa! Dad, now swing right. Oh, you must go faster. Now swing left. What, like this? <laughs> Lean your legs the other way. Like this? Fantastic. Just a little to the left. Ooh, that wasn't meant to happen. I'm out of control. <laughs> Let's go turbo. Oh, that's the emergency brake. Woo, <laughs> yay. Woo Yes! Well done. So much for aerodynamics. What happened to JG's mega car? I'm not sure. I did overtake him. Oh. Are you okay, JG? I'm fine. Just my pride that's damaged. <gasps> Where did you get these from, JG? Oh, I made them from those old skewers you had in your toolbox, Shane. Sizzling saucepans. My kebabs. Thanks for helping, JG. Oh, it's the least I could do, Shane. If only I could find you some new skewers. Never mind. I'll just have to put everything in the oven and make a lamb and vegetable grill. That's probably enough rosemary for now. Right you are. What do you want to do with these sticks? Sticks? Rosemary sticks? Oh, thanks, JG. You've just saved the day. Me? Well, what did I do? I can use these rosemary sticks to make wooden kebab skewers. Nice and simple. Let's get cooking. Lamb and veggie kebabs. Mm hmm. Tuck in, everyone. Mm, tasty. Mm. Mm. Delicious. Delicious and so simple. Just like Izzy's winning go kart. <laughs> Who's for another kebab? Oh, thanks, Shane. Very clever, Shane. Using the rosemary sticks to make the skewers. Ah, it was simple, really. And simple is best. Isn't it, JG? No, <laughs> oh, I'll never live this down. Wonky veg. With Shane the Chef. Oh, and here she is. Hi, everyone. You ready for your big day, Maggie? Oh, I can't wait. I'm so excited about my new veggie box scheme. <laughs> yeah, look, I've done you a little display to advertise it. Oh, that's lovely, Shane. And I've got JG's megaphone all ready. This is a oh, megaphone! Whoa. <laughs> Mario! Sorry, Shane. I still don't guess it. What's so special about vegetables in boxes? Oh, well, I'll be delivering them straight from the farm to people's doors. <laughs> it was Shane's idea. <laughs> you can't get much fresher than that. And it helps people eat more seasonal veg. I think I'm all set. I just need to dig up the last of the vegetables. Any volunteers? I'll help. Me too. I love digging. You just love finding wiggly worms. Oh, yeah. There'll be plenty of those. <laughs> Hi, Maggie. Just going to get started on your new sign. I'm helping out as well. Don't want to miss out on the action. Got me guitar too. Might have a song for you later. Everybody's being so kind. We're all behind you, Maggie. Thanks, everyone. I've got a feeling my veggie boxes are going to be a big success. <laughs> The display's great, Shane. Perfect inspiration for the sign. Uh, hmm. Yes. So, Sid's going to do some painting too. He's going to paint one side of the sign while I paint the other. He's, um, he's very enthusiastic. Well, let's hope his painting skills are as good as his singing ones. <gasps> Excuse me. <laughs> oh, Sid. That's it. Get 
get stuck in? Mario, stop it. Uh, oh, sorry, Izzy. Come on, Wormy, come to Mario. I wonder what it's thinking. Not much. They just eat soil one end till it comes out the other. <laughs> <laughs> hey, look at this carrot. It looks like a dinosaur. <laughs> A Carotosaurus. Oh, the ground's a bit stony around here, so when the roots hit the stones, the veg grows a bit wonky. This one's like an octopus. <laughs> That's a turnip. It's got tentacles. <laughs> Octi the octopus is going to trap you in his tentacles. Hey, my Carotosaurus is a peace-loving herbivore. With a big heart. <laughs> <laughs> right, we'd better get these packed. My customers will be waiting. In you go, Octi. <laughs> Oh, that looks great, Penny. Yes, I think it's coming along nicely. What are you painting, Sid? You'll just have to wait and see. Ready, Shane? The kids are on their way. They're going to help with the deliveries. <laughs> Sounds like the perfect time for my song. Oh, no. Oh, Maggie, what can I say? This is your beautiful veggie day. <laughs> <laughs> Brilliant! OK. Let's go. Roll up, roll up. Come and get them. Maggie's lovely vegetable boxes straight from the farm to your doorstep. Huh? Hey. From field to fork, fresh, tasty veg. Ooh. Maggie's lovely vegetable boxes straight from Yum. the farm yes. to your doorstep. Good boy, Mario. Ooh, what is that? Oh, delicious. What? Oh. Calm down, Eddie. It's just a courgette. Snake! Lovely. Ah! Look what I found in my box! An octopus turnip? And I found a snake courgette. I'm afraid I don't fancy eating a carrot dinosaur, Maggie. We'd prefer normal vegetables, please. Not funny-shaped ones. Quite right, Mama Polenta. That goes for me, too. But it doesn't matter about the shape. But it's the taste that counts. Mm. Yuck! Oh. What am I going to do? Oh, I can't help the shape of my vegetables. If people only want straight vegetables, my box scheme won't work. I just don't have enough. Don't worry, Maggie. All we need to do is to make them into a tasty dish. That way, people will see they taste just as good as straight vegetables. I'm not so sure, Shane. They might think that just because you're a good chef. Yeah, Dad. You can make anything taste good. Grown-ups are really weird. Wonky veg are much more fun to eat. Yeah, all those funny shapes. Bet they wouldn't be able to taste a difference anyway. That's it. Izzy, you're a genius. I am? We'll do a taste test. The wonky roast vegetables versus the normal ones. And then let's see if people can tell the difference. Cool. The grown-ups will have to eat what we give them for once. Eat your greens, Mama. <laughs> <laughs> well, it's worth a try. I'd better go and tell everyone. That's OK. You leave that to me. Um, that's quite an unusual shape. Sid, I need your help. See? Someone appreciates my painting talents. Well, it's not those talents I'm after. Just as well. Join us for a meal delight. Here and fresh with us tonight. Test your taste buds to see if they're right. Here and fresh with us tonight. Wonky or straight, which tastes the best? You might be surprised when you take our test. Come along. Here and fresh tonight. <laughs> Ooh, come on, Mama Polenta. OK. I'm sure I'll be able to taste the difference, no problem. Right, you guys. First, you need to scrub all the vegetables, the straight ones and the wonky ones. Bye-bye, Carotosaurus. And turnip octopus. And potato heart. <laughs> <laughs> Then, while they're roasting, we'll make a herby dip to go with them. Sounds delicious. <laughs> what are we waiting for? Let's get cooking.
job done. I hope this works. Good evening, everyone. First, you all have to wear these. Ooh. Oh. Ooh. <laughs> this is exciting. Reminds me of the time when I was marched to a secret Inca temple in the middle of the jungle. I was blindfolded for 12 days and 12 nights. Everyone ready? Oh. No peeking now. I can't see a thing. OK, Shane. Here we go. Right. Who's first? Me. Here it comes. Oh, yummy. Now, this one. Oh, delicious. So, which one tastes the best? Oh, oh, maybe the first one. No, wait, the second one. No, I don't know. Come on, Mama, open wide. Mmm. Mmm, very nice. And the second one. Also very nice. But which one was wonky and which one was straight? Oh, I don't know. Oh, I, um... I'm a little confused. Now, that really is a tasty carrot. And how about this one? And that's an even tastier one. Of course. That's my Carrotosaurus. What? There you go. You've just eaten the wonky veg and the straight veg. And none of you could tell the difference. <laughs> oh. Well, not even Mama. I'm sorry, Maggie. I think I might have been a little hasty earlier. Mm. It really is very good. That's the best dinosaur I've ever tasted. Shane, it worked. Oh, thank you. Oh. <laughs> Hi, Maggie. Your new sign is ready. That's wonderful, Penny. <gasps> You're such a talent. Hey, what about my sign? <gasps> Sizzling saucepans. It looks like an orange banana. <laughs> hey, that's my carrot you're talking about. A carrot? But it's all wonky. Well, it's supposed to be modern. Sid, dear, I think I'd better paint that again. No, don't. It's perfect. Huh? A wonky carrot sign for my wonky veg business. <laughs> what could be better? 